every single day, a corporation goes through a number of transactions. Now what I want to do is illustrate how a transaction affects the balance sheet and we will use something called journal entries to give you more exposure as to when to debit or when to credit. The introduction of financial reporting can be dated back to the 1400s with Luca Pacioli, who introduced the idea of having debits and having credits to go about introducing the fluctuations of assets, liabilities, and equity on a balance sheet. Debits are usually on the left side, credits are on the right side. Now the question that arises is when necessarily do you debit a specific account on the balance sheet and when do you credit one? Well, here's a very easy way to learn. Always debit when one of your assets, which is on the left side of the balance sheet, is increasing, meaning you, as a corporation, are receiving cash, for example. On the opposite end, you always credit an asset when the asset is going down. So for example, a payment of anything. Now, because liabilities and owner's equity are on the opposite side of the balance sheet as assets, it has a different effect. When liabilities go down, you debit the liability. When liabilities go up, you credit. Similarly, because liabilities and owner's equity are on the same side, they have the same effect.